What's going on guys? Ryan here with Jetta Patrol. Today we're going to cover my top 10 exclusive Funko Pops of 2019. Let's do it. That's right guys, Ryan here with Jetta Patrol. Welcome back to another video. It's been a pretty good week. We've had a lot of cool videos the past few days, so if you haven't checked those out, definitely go back. Check those out because there may be some special prizes hidden in those videos just like there may be one in this one i don't know might have to stick around to the middle or the end or something like that i may have a certain certain surprise for my friends over at display geek I, I hate to like just throw it out there but i'm going to throw it out there and it's here in the video somewhere before we get to any of that i thought it'd be fun to take a look at my favorite top 10 exclusive Funko Pops for 2019. Now again, this is my favorite 10. That may not be yours, and I guarantee you it's probably not. And I've got 10 of them here, and they are in no particular order, but I thought I'd cover my top 10 exclusives. And over 2019, I've definitely been way more selective on what I'm buying. 2018, 2017, I bought pretty, if they, if they release it, I bought it. That's just, that's how I rolled. And that's how I ended up with almost a thousand Pops. But 2019, I said, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull back a little bit. I'm gonna be a little bit more selective. I'm gonna be a little bit smarter with my dollars and uh, not buy everything that they drop because they make 1,000 pieces uh, for every freaking movie. Uh, just, anyway, stay tuned, you'll see. When, when the new uh, Rise of Skywalker Star Wars film drops, they've already dropped some of the pops. Guarantee you there'll be another like 50 of that wave. I am only looking for the exclusives. That's what's up. So I got 10 down here, and like I said, these are in no particular order. It'd be fun to let, you, uh, let me know what your top 10 would be, maybe your top five if you don't have a top 10. But I'm only looking at exclusives. That's what I'm looking at. I'm not caring about chases. I don't care about commons, any of that stuff, just exclusives. So uh, just looking at what I've got down here. Uh, let's go with, uh, we'll, go, we'll just go with the first one. You ready? Now this is, this is gonna be fun if you guys actually guess any of these. That would be kind of cool, but I doubt you will. Are you ready for this? It is Marvel Collector Core Valkyrie. Yes, that's right. I said Marvel Collector Core Valkyrie. This one is awesome. Now I do have the, uh, the other Valkyrie. I think it's from San Diego Comic-Con. I think that's what that was from. I have that one, but this one, the hair mold and everything is just super cool. I mean, just take a look at this. Not only that, but it also came with, uh, came from a, an amazing film. It was, uh, Endgame was fantastic. But here we go, exclusive Marvel Collector Core. This is awesome, number 483 in the line. And there she is. I'm still waiting on my six scale figure of Valkyrie. So Hot Toys, uh, where are you at? Listen up, I need that. So that one's gonna be number one on the list there. And like I said, I don't have an order. We're just kind of going through these. I'm just gonna pick some at random. Um, where are we gonna go? Okay. So I actually teased this pop one year before it actually existed. That's right, I teased it one year before it existed. It is none other, none other than, that's right, Prison Mike, Prison Mike from The Office. All right, Hot Topic exclusive, this thing is awesome. Check out this thing, it is cool. It's got his purple bandana, it's got a Hot Topic exclusive sticker, which is pretty cool, because I haven't, don't think I've picked up a lot of Hot Topic exclusives. Uh, this year. Uh, number 875 in the line. There it is. Prison Mike from the Office lineup. Now, I have not picked up any of the comments from the Office lineup yet. I haven't picked up any of those. I've just been picking up the exclusives. Uh, but there you go. That is super cool pop. Prison Mike. Uh, watch out for those Dementors because they're, they're the worst, man. And you got to eat gruel all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Such a classic episode. I've still got some friends of mine who have not watched The Office, or they've watched like two or three episodes and they don't get it. And I, I gotta unfriend those people. I'm just, uh, I guess, I just gotta do it. Um, all right, so let's go. Um, yeah, let's, let's just do one more. Here we go. You ready for this one? This one's also from The Office, and I, like I said, I didn't put these in any particular order. This is just, I'm just grabbing them randomly. I have to have a stack down here. This one is a Target exclusive from Target Con number three, I think it was. And it is, that's right, Golden Face, Golden Face. Jim Halpert as Golden Face from Michael Scarn. I'm telling you, man, this is a super cool pop. Now, I don't typically, you know, dig like glittery pops, but this one actually made sense. I mean, he's got all this nice, like greenish glitter going on in the face. Got Target sticker number 877, this line. The box is awesome. And it just came from a, a really cool episode of, of The Office. So, um, 
golden face Jim Halpert, so that's pretty cool. Now, I do have some other ones. I think I've got Hey King, Dwight, I think it's a Walmart exclusive, and I've got the Funko Shop uh, Halloween costume Jim, and I've got Jim as Dwight, and I've got a couple of different ones. But these uh, stand out to me, at least from that particular line, as being really you know, above and beyond for the ones for 2019. So let's move on. on. Let's go with, uh, can we get to Star Wars? Yeah, we, we can get to Star Wars, right? Let's start. We can, we can do Star Wars. All right, you ready for this? Uh, this would be Star Wars Celebration 2019. And they dropped a whole bunch of chromes. They dropped like green chromes and then blue chromes. And depending on if you're at the shared exclusives or if you're at the con and blah, blah. I don't care nothing about chromes. So I didn't get any of those. But I did get this one. And it is, bam, Darth Maul. Super cool, super cool Darth Maul. Star Wars Celebration 2019. What an awesome box as well. So pretty cool sticker. I do have uh, another Darth Maul that is actually autographed by Ray Park, who played Darth Maul in uh, The Phantom Menace. But check that out. That's awesome box art. Pretty cool pop right there. So that one's cool. Uh, he's actually got his like sabers like half broken. Um, in fact, I've got yeah, I think uh, I've got all my autograph pops on this wall here. So I've got. Uh, uh, what have I got? I got uh, Obi Wan Kenobi. I've got uh, Ahsoka from Ashley Eckstein. I've got Ray Park over here. I've got uh, Bender um, from Futurama as well. So I got some other ones, but uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, let's move on to the next one. Let's go with another Star Wars. One. Man, I got a lot. I got a lot of Star Wars ones. Um, I got some Marvel ones too. All right, so let's go with this one. This one. This one might be a surprise to you, but I recently picked up. Uh, I let me show you this. Can I, can I show you this? I recently picked this thing up. Alright, so I recently picked up this uh, Boba Fett Hot Toy figure. Now this is from the animated show Christmas Classic way back when. That is so... Well, it's, it's, it was cool for the time. It was cool for the time. Uh, but I just picked this up. So when I grabbed this uh, at a recent Comic Con, I had to go to GameStop and get the pop to go with it. I had to do it. I had to do it. I had to do it. Uh, so that's super, super cool. So I did get this one. Let's see if I can show you guys this one. Uh, but he does have the uh, the teal. He's got his pulse rifle going on. This is the new Game Shop stick or Game Shop Game Stop sticker that they uh, changed up in 2019, I believe. Uh, but there it is, number 305 in that line. And I really wasn't planning on picking this up until I got this guy. And I was like, you know what? I kind of got to have both, so I did. And then after I took it out of the box, the cape, like, it's just it's cool pop. I just I just like. It. So there's uh, number five, I guess. Five more to go. Continuing on with Star Wars. I believe this was New York Comic Con 2019. New York Comic Con 2019, which I really wanted to go to. So next year, 2020, I've got to do a better job at uh, arranging things to make that happen. All right, but here we go. You ready? Sand Trooper 2019. This is amazing. I have uh, some six scale figures of this. I have a do back that goes with it. I've got other pops. This one. The mold is just fantastic. I love the sticker, 2019 uh, Fall Convention. Shared exclusive for uh, New York Comic Con. Number 322 in the line. Sand Trooper, this was a Target exclusive. If you missed out on this one and you are a Star Wars fan at all, please do yourself a favor and go get this pop. It is super awesome. So there's that one. Let's move on. I got another Marvel. You wanna do Marvel? Let's do Marvel. Uh, I'll see here. Let's do another Marvel Collector Core, which you're gonna see is very familiar. And it is, it's Cap. We got Cap, Marvel Collector Core Cap. This one was our first look at Cap with uh, Thor's hammer, and it is super, super cool. Now, they have recently released one uh, that is a little cooler in pose and dy uh, dynamic and all this, but this is a exclusive uh, you know, video. We'll look at some commons in another video. Today's for exclusives. That's a common. This is exclusive. This one kicked it off. Now, at one point, this thing was going for like 100 bucks. Uh, number 481 in the lineup. He's got the shield. He's got Mjolnir back there. I mean, at, at, this was at the peak of the Avengers Endgame hype. This thing, once it sold out on Amazon, whoo boy. People were flipping out over it, going for 100 bucks or so. I don't know what it's going for right now. I don't even care because it's staying in the collection. But it's um, it's very cool. I'm very happy to have it. And the fact that it came with Valkyrie, um, that was just a bonus. That was a bonus. All right, so I've got three more. And then I've got something cool for you guys from Display Geek, and um, they are also exclusives. Just saying, just saying. All right, so uh, let's go. With, oh, Disney Park exclusive, Hondo Anaka. Oh yeah, this one is amazing. I did a whole video unboxing on this one. This one is super amazing. I picked this one up on Mercari, I believe, 
And uh, yeah, pretty uh, pretty awesome. Uh, Galaxy's uh, Landing right here, or Galaxy's Edge Landing 2019. Hondo, the Pirate, I'm telling you right here, just a super, super awesome pop. And uh, it's it's just, I haven't made it to Galaxy's Edge yet, so I'm hoping in 2020 I'll have an opportunity to get down to Florida, uh, to Orlando, and go check it out, build myself a lightsaber, get those Ahsoka Tano lightsabers. I really want those things. And uh, just experience the whole thing. So uh, I hope to make that happen. Uh, next year. So there's Hondo Anaka. Clone Wars fans, Rebels fans, all you guys. That's just good stuff. All right, so I got two more. Let's do uh, another Marvel one. This one is actually recent, and uh, I picked up two, and I actually had I traded one of these for the next one I'm going to show you, but we'll get there in a second. Uh, this is the Stan Lee. So the New York Comic Con Stan Lee, uh, as the Astronaut from the the end scene from uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two. Look at this thing, it's super awesome. I have the hot toy figure of this, although I'm not keeping it because I'm kind of focusing the collection on Star Wars mainly. But that's okay. The hot toy figure is amazing. I did do a video on that if you want to check it out. Uh, but here it is, number five nineteen. This line, the pop is awesome. I will be keeping this in the collection, and I just kind of dig it. So I think that's nine. Yeah, that's nine. So the last one, actually, like I said, I bought two of these. I traded this one for another one from a good friend, Eric. So shout out to you, brother. Thank you very much uh, for hooking me up on this. And it is the hype of all Star Wars pops for 2019, right? Probably the best one because of the source material. Are you ready for this? It is none other than the Funko Shop Mandalorian. This thing is awesome. Guys, if you haven't been watching The Mandalorian, what freaking planet are you living on? Holy cow, look at this thing. Now, we uh, just started a brand new show, a series on the channel called Java Jawa Jaw. We're just three random dudes with YouTube channels who get together every Saturday morning where we celebrate the two constants in our lives that bring us a daily dose of serenity, coffee, and Star Wars. We call it Java Jawa Jaw. We are on episode five. By the time you see this, we'll be starting to record episode five this weekend. And um, it's super exciting with my buddy Kent and Terry, and we're just having a lot of fun with that. So this is number 330 in the line. This was the Funko Shop exclusive variant. And there we go, The Mandalorian. Just a super, the show is just next level awesome. It just, I don't know, it just ticks all the boxes, man. It's got excitement, it's got visual appeal, it's got great storyline, it's got great pace, acting, whoo, just good stuff. Okay, you stuck around for this because it's awesome. Not only do I have the awesome top 10, which I would love for you guys in the comment section down below. Let me know your top 10, top five, however many you want to share with me. Exclusives. We'll look at commons and stuff the other, later on. Um, but uh, my buddy over at Display Geek hit me up, said, hey, dude, I want to send you some stuff for the channel. And I thought we'd just kind of take a look, see what it is, because it's here. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. Bam. All right, there we go. Let's just see what's in here, guys. And I hope you guys are excited about this, because because I am. I am. Let's see what we got. You ready? All right. There we go. Display geek. Display cases. Protectors collectibles. Thank you. We love you. Hey, well, love you too, man. <laughs> so save around 5% of your next order by using the code we love you at checkout. Uh-oh. Spoiler. There you go. There's your code. I didn't even know that was in there. That's awesome. Uh, check it out right there. So there's their Instagram, at Display Geek. And I'll, like, I'll put a, a link to their website in the uh, description below, but it is DisplayGeek.com. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's see what he sent us. You ready? Oh, oh, look at that packaging, yo. What's up? I feel like let's just do one at a time. Look at that packaging. Woo. All right. Let's, let's see what it is. You ready? Let's do this. It's like a mystery. I, it's a mystery box. I don't even know. Don't even know. Oh. <laughs> How about that, guys? I know you guys like some ad icons. I know. You like some ad icons. This right here, guys, is the Funko Hollywood exclusive limited edition Tony the Tiger with sunglasses. Number 63 in the ad icons line. And how awesome is that, Frosted Flakes? Now, I have never, ever had the original Tony the Tiger. I've never owned it. 
So uh, that's pretty cool. Let's open this bad boy up. Display Geek got his own pop protector going on right there. That's cool. All right, so let's let's uh, let's go ahead and open this up. It feels like a very solid pop protector, by the way. All right, so let's open this thing up. Take a look at the pop. I haven't seen the pop in person, obviously. Okay, let's open this thing up. Let's take a look at Tony. I was this close to getting the flock Tony the Tiger when it dropped in the Christmas bundle. It was like two years ago. I was this close, but man, their website with those 504 errors, it was it was terrible. It's terrible. But let's check this guy out. Super, super cool. There he is, guys. Tony the Tiger. How awesome is that with the sunglasses going on? That is super cool. Now, for someone, I'm not collecting ad icons any longer, but if you were, that is one. That's a must-have. That is a must-have pop for an ad icon collector. It is just super cool. I dig it, man. Display Geek. Thank you, brother. I very much appreciate that. Let's put this back in the box. That's pretty cool. Let's see what else he's in us. All right, you ready? Okay. Let's see what this is. Oh, that's another ad icon. Bam, look at that. We got Chester Cheetah Funko Hollywood exclusive number 78. I like this one very, very much. I really do. I really like this one. Um, let's see here. Let's go here. I like this one. And this is another one I predicted before it ever existed, actually. Uh, it is, it is. All right, let's check this thing out. I like this one because it's got the, the sunglasses and he's actually holding a bag of Cheetos. I mean, that's just, that's cool. Tony uh, is not, he's just got the, you know, it's great thing going on. It would be cool if he was, had like a box of Frosted Flakes in his hand. That would be cool. Oh, we got a clamshell packaging here. Woo, that was loud, sorry. Look at this. You guys gotta let me know which one you like better. I gotta be honest with you, I'm kind of leaning towards uh, Chester here. He's just, he's got that swagger, man. He's, he's, he's got the Cheetos. Now, they should be the fire, or the, the spicy ones, like the fire Cheetos or hot, whatever the heck they're called. Um, you should have those, that would be cool. And uh, I mean, just look, just super, super cool. Look at all the spots and everything. All that swagger, absolutely love it. The sunglasses. That's, that's what makes it, man. That's just super cool. So, yeah, that's that's what we got, guys. I have two awesome ad icons. Uh, and um, like I told you earlier, I'm not collecting ad icons any longer. All right, so I came up with a cool way, I think, to, to kind of give these things away. We're going to give these away to two different winners, so one person is not going to get both. I want to spread the love around when we hook that up. So we got Chester Cheetah and we got Tony the Tiger. So here's what I thought we would do. I would like you guys to go to displaygeek.com right there displaygeek.com and on there check out his displays he's got custom displays for all kinds of different things in box pops out of box pops check out his website let me know the favorite display your favorite display out of all the stuff that's on his website in the comment section down below and use the hashtag Jetta Christmas I might have done this in a previous video just saying might have in the comment section down below let me know your favorite display piece that he has in his shop and also with the hashtag Jetta Christmas. And then also, and let me know which one of these you would like to have. Would it be Tony? Would it be Chester? I don't know, but that's all we're gonna do. So Display Geek, thank you brother for uh, sending these over. I know somebody out there is gonna have a great Christmas because they're gonna get some awesome ad icons courtesy of you brother. So thank you very much. Guys, as always, collect what you like. Have a good time doing it.